back to the channel viewers we're at a uh, motoology in Cebu so look at this this is going to be a bit of a treat all the uh, big bikes in the window here so at motoology Cebu let's go in and have a look so I hear a sound of a bike revving and this is another place that's called whole shot big bikes so it's in a bit of a complex um, so there's a place over there uh, drew bikes over there so this will be a bit of a treat so that's motoology up there so let's go in here and have a look a few big bikes over there <laughs> so we've got here some Kawasaki some trail bikes there GSX S GT nice bike Kawasaki 400 some ninjas oh look at that i'd love one of these things jet skis the old stand-up jet skis they're pretty rare some v-strom so look at this the v-strom it's probably a, oh it's a thousand thousand and fifty v-strom ah oh, nice bike nice colors so trick and then this is the baby one i suppose a 650 and this one over here the sx that's a 250 V Strom. That's very interesting, you know, it's the 250 V Strom. So that's nice. Very mm, nice. And what is this thing? Oh, this is one of these electric boards that you sit on, I think. And you use this handle here to zoom along. So try to have a look at one of these things. Oh boys and their toys wow 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 look at this jet ski wave runner i think they're about two million pesos so 50 55 us dollars to one sorry 55 pesos to one us dollar 37 pesos to one australian dollar so just have a look and uh i'll have a have a squeeze through here nice v-strom oh and we have look at this Kawasaki 650 in the old colour scheme. Wow. That is nice. That's in the old Quacker 9 style. So there's a Quacker 650. Very, very nice. And further on, we have some oils and some accessories in here. Let's have a look. Some helmets, motorcycle boots. It's a fair bit available. Yeah, so yeah, a little uh, 400 Kawasaki in here as well. So there you go. That's the first little shop. So that's a bit of a treat for me. Hopefully for you as well. And we'll duck into the next shop soon. Bye. Welcome back, viewers. There, look at what I found over here. Rusting away, a 59 Bel Air. Very nice. And over here, we've got uh, Kimco, Taiwanese brand. So they're all uh, the scooters in there. And let's, uh, we've got some helmets over in there, HJC. And then we're gonna head into Motoology. So let's have a look in here and see what sort of bikes they've got in here. So come in, welcome, main hapun. So they've got a few. The old Royal Enfield over here. What is this thing? Oh, 701 Husqvarna. That's a trick looking bike. I've seen one of these in Dumaguete, but the Royal Anfield Classic 500. It's 250,000 pesos. So there you go. Classic 500. Looks like an old matchless that I used to have. And then this thing is Honda Cross Tour, whatever that is. It's a nice looking bike. Look where the horns are. The horns are a bit funny, but uh, yeah, I'll find out the price and I'll put a put something up on there. So nice bike, wide wheels, single sided swing arm. Cool. And then they've just got a lot of helmets and apparel and tires which is handy to know here so you can get a, a range of tires and jackets and pants 
which is cool over there. Some pants, some leathers, if you want good leathers. Come to Motoology in Cebu. Look at these cool looking helmets. Wow. And then over here, more jackets, more helmets. Here's some helmets. Pretty jazzy helmets. And then you've even got some uh, footwear. So you've got some racing boots, which is handy. They're nice. And that's it. So that's Motorology. So we'll check out a few other places and I'll get back to you soon. Okay, bye. Here we are at Drew Bikes. So got a nice rig sitting out the front. Let's have a look at what we've got here. It looks like a few bikes, a few jet skis. That's handy, love a jet ski, CBR Repsol. Nice. Look at that little Gorilla Honda in the sea -Doo. That's nice too. So we're coming here, GSX. This is like, the, I had one of these in the old days, a little Z50 Honda. Wow, they're worth a fortune now in Australia, I know that. And look at the nice helmets. What a pretty cool motorcycle shop. Some saddlebags, some side bags, which are quite rare. Side hard cases. k and high flow filter, they're quite rare. Some uh, racing boots stands so you can see in Cebu you can get a fair bit of a fair bit of different um variety of things and look at the size of these boxes my lord they're huge the plates and all that to fit them the helmets some four wheelers that's a 300 look at this beast it's a bit chunky and you've got all the different accessories and uh parts interesting place so got all different fairings some more helmets over here a bit of something for your bar at home or wherever a of, a bit of novelties spotlights and then you've got all the fancy air cleaners vance and hind stuff so that'd be for a harley's some spotlights, some tires. Look at this beast, 550. T Boss, that'd be good. Don't know if you can get it registered or not. So, uh, beautiful looking thing. So, it's amazing. Bell helmets. Get all the different bell helmets, which is nice. So, you can see it's a lot different from Dumaghetti. We got the brand new Suzuki GSX R 600, and then BMW S1000 Harley. Wow, well, sporty 883. Nice and a big bang. Vance and Hines. And this one, a Vulcan custom. <laughs> Oh, that sounds tough. Ooh. Roadstar. So that's, I think, the Yamaha version. So we'll come over here. You've got all your mufflers. Little Yoshimura mufflers. As long as you're Acropovic. A few more accessories over here. Roadstar. So great, and then we bit of a workshop in there. And then we head upstairs. So let's go upstairs and have a look. I love stairs. Not so we'll have a look here. Ooh, RR Honda. Okay, so viewers, so there's some lots of bikes, and then we've got a special treat for you, viewers. So there's the BMW here, and have a look at this beast. Hello, mate. Hello, champ. How are you? You're a good boy, hey? Yeah, you're a good boy, hey? Look at that. 
Look at the size of this thing in the motorcycle shop. Great stuff. Hey, I won't put my finger near you. All right, viewers, I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> so that was downstairs. Here's a young lady that works here. Say hi. 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 And then we come upstairs and look at what we got up here. CBR 400, nice bike. Wow, got a lot of bikes up here. Lots of helmets. What have we got over here? Looks like a, an R1 or something like that. Here we go downstairs. So careful where to walk. That's nice, nice color. Another one. Here in a Honda 1000 RR, so that's a, I think, uh, Kevy's got one of these. VFR, I think. Let's have a look, Castro, oh, nice bike. Like a race bike. So, nice place, let's go and have a look over here. I love motorcycle shops, I'm sure you do too. It's like, you know, I leave the clothes shops to the girls and uh, motorcycle shops over here to me, so. Oh, an Aprilia Tuano, by the looks of it. I had one of them. Beautiful, beautiful bike. Let me squeeze through here. And look at these push bikes. Custom push bikes. Pretty cool. And then Bandit, Suzuki Bandit 1200. Wow, iconic. Iconic bikes, really, really reliable. Um, and then Aprilia Racing, Type R. What have we got here? A oh, Buell, wow. Buell, quite rare. And then a Translap, it's a Honda. Translap Rally Touring. So you can see Sabu's a bit of a surprise with the bike shopping, that's fantastic. So this whole area, the complex over there, um, motorology, and then you've got Cafe Racer there, just over here, and at night time they play you know, bands and you can have a beer and sit down and enjoy yourself. So it's got a fair bit to offer, and this is only just one part of Cebu. Cebu's a big city, it's the oldest city in the Philippines, and uh, you can see the bikes that are available to look at. So uh, I'll sign off now and I'll catch you shortly. Bye. Go. Wow, thanks man. <laughs> so, so viewers, this is Cafe Racer. There's one of these places in Dumaguete. It's a pretty cool place as well. It's got some memorabilia in it, but uh, this is where everybody can sit down and there's a, they normally have a live band and it looks like they're setting one up now which looks pretty cool. And then everybody sits around at these tables and Harley Davidson and Cebu. So this is the whole complex. And uh, yeah, we can actually go in there and have a look, I suppose. Let's go in and have a look. Oh wow, they've got the combi there. Hello, right, Robert. <laughs> Look at this cafe racer, so nice place, lots of food, lots of decor, little cool place, the aircon's going, there's a nice place to eat. You can sort of sit on these uh, rather cool seats. And we've got half a Volkswagen up the back. Route 66. Ah, nice place. Cool, so yeah, if you're in Cebu, come to Cafe Racer. Bye. Motorology, bikes, 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 bikes. Car bikes. Cool old car. Let's go around and have a look at this, viewers. Wow, oh wow, it's seen better days. dash look at that rusted away could you save it
Oh, the music's coming. Well, this is going to pump it later. Cafe Racer, Cebu. Mandalay City. All right, I'll catch ya. Oh, even the old friends like it here. There we go. <laughs> My traveling buddy, having a good time. <laughs> oh, there's another old car out the front. Here we go, so we've got the DJ. Barbecue, hot dog, burger, coffee, sandwich, ice cream. Before, Welcome back viewers, we're at the next uh, motorcycle place and it is called Wheeltech. It's in uh, Lapu Lapu, which is over the bridge uh, from Main Cebu, so let's have a look in here. Apparently it's got uh, some big bikes, it looks like a big setup, so let's go in and have a look at what it's got. Mad traffic in Cebu, you can hear in the background, but let's have a look. Have a look. Got some little bikes. All the little stuff. We'll go upstairs. Oh, there's the new colour scheme of the Sniper 155. That looks cool. So we'll go up and have a look. Oh, look, I'm excited. I'm excited already, big bikes. Let's have a look. We saw one of these yesterday. GSX. Oh, we've got the Versailles, the Kawasaki Versailles. Brand new. Oh, and another Suzuki DL. So, yeah, Kawasaki Versailles. What's this one? Nice bikes. This is Suzuki. There's more through there. All the little babies. Little Jixa. They're pretty popular. Little Suzuki Jixa. There's a Suzuki SX250. That's nice. Here's one here sold to Mr. John. Ah, there's the 650. We we're looking at these yesterday. They were a great bike. 549,000 pesos. Just under 10,000 US. Really good bike. You know, not too heavy. Still heavy enough, but uh, all the jixes. And then we'll come through there. Can you get through there? No. Oh, it's closed. So, we have to have a look over there. Not a lot. Anyhow, that's what we've got here in Lapu Lapu. So, we'll try to get through there. If I can't get through there, we'll keep going. And we're going to go to uh, BMW. And on, on a couple of days, we're going to go to Harley and KDM, etc. So, stay tuned. We'll be back. Well, we're into the other side now, viewers. And uh, what have I found here? This is a big Suzuki. DL 1000 V Strum looks nice, doesn't it? In that color, I like that. It's got the crash bars on it, the water bottle, the lights. I think a different fairing. See this sticker? 
Iron Man, Boss Iron Man Motorcycle Challenge. That means he's done a thousand kilometers in one day. Now, you probably giggle and say, oh, that's not many, but in the Philippines, that's a lot, believe me, especially with the road condition. So, got a few bikes over here. Here's the Suzuki Raider. They are a fast little bike. Really nice little pocket rocket. And we have some bikes here. Let's have a look. Let's go in. Oh, here we go. Oh, look at this. I'm excited. Z9 Kawasaki. Wow. You love the colour? I do. Z650, another Z650 like yesterday. That is, that is sweet. And then you've got, I think this is the H2 supercharged. Yeah. ZH2, that's a supercharged. That's like <laughs> super fast. Um, Vulcan, Kawasaki Vulcan. Yeah, it doesn't do much for me, but it looks comfortable. Big, nice seat, like a Harley. And uh, here's the Z1000 and different uh, racing bikes. We've got over here. This is the lounge. That's another 650. So it's nice and a ninja for those who like to uh, lean over forward and go fast. So that's nice. And um, there's a nice one here. It's with the ZX6. Nice little white 650. And the Verse. Versailles 650. Very popular. And then you've got your trail bikes, the KLXs over there. A bit more of an upright Kawasaki. That's a Z9. But more trail bikes. So, yeah, I don't know if I like this one, viewers, but you, you know. I think I'd go for the rather traditional um, Z9 that I showed you when we walked in and I'm just gonna go back to it because I love it. It's very impressive. This is, this is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Nice headlight. And here. Anyhow, off to the next bike shop. I hope you enjoyed that. Bye-bye. Yeah. Welcome back, viewers. Well, here we are. We are at Ducati. So let's go in and have a look. This will be interesting. I love these things. So we have a Multistrada. Nice bikes, Ducati. World Championship bikes. Have a look at this. Sexy, sexy, sexy Ducatis. What have we got here? Let's check out a couple of prices. Ooh, there we go, 1.415. Street Finder, 1.4. This one, 1.2, that's cheap. Nice. Oh, look at this Hypermoto 950 SP. Beautiful. What have we got? Ooh, 1.7. Oh, so cool. oh, look at this. Sexy, sexy, sexy Multistrada. Save your bickies, save your money for these things. Gorgeous bikes, though. Gorgeous bikes. And then if we've got a little baby, the monsters. Multistrata. Another Multistrata. Nice. All available, all the t-shirts. Scrambler, oh, we've got a scrambler here. Oh, that's under a mil. There you go, that's nice. Some other scramblers here. 
So this is what's available in Cebu. If you want to buy a Ducati, just come down to Cebu. If you're not in Manila, you get a few things. Bit of a Ducati bag. 26.7. And Ducati helmets, Corsa helmets, headlights, etc. Very, very nice. A bit more paraphern paraphernalia here. The gloves. Even a bit of a Meccano toy there. All the the t-shirts and the service center. So you've got a service center here. Fully equipped service center. Some pipes and that is Ducati. So I hope you enjoyed that little tour of Ducati in Cebu. I'll catch you at the next shop. Bye. So just a quick one, we're back at Ducati. I just got to mention the girls here. Hello, girls. Hi, welcome to the Cebu. Oh, to Caddy Cebu. So they're very helpful on giving me all the prices. And just a heads up, how much is a major service on a big oh, Ducati? For uh, 30 km. 30,000 30, kilometers, yeah. Uh, that would be almost 70,000. 70,000, a Desmo yeah. service, so that's belt, spark plug, etc., yeah. whatever it needs. And, and a normal oil chain service is? Around 10,000. 10, Including the oil and the oil. All right, so bring your checkbook, boys. Mm -hmm. If you come buy a Ducati, beautiful, sexy bikes. But uh, yeah, they can have a quite an experience in service. So thanks, girls. Thank you. Thank we'll you, see you later. Bye bye. Bye. Thanks for coming. Bye. <laughs> Good morning, viewers from Cebu. We're at a bike shop, of course, BMW. So BMW and Cebu, BMW Motorrad. So let's go on in and have a look, as promised. We'll check out all the bikes. <sighs> Mambuntak. Here we go, just a few BMWs. This is what's available. Jeez, look at these big boys. All the top ones. 850. That's what we come to have a look at. All the 1250. So, if you want an option of spending, getting a big bike, a big BMW, you got lots. Here's a. I like this one, the 850 GS. Still looks huge. But we'll get some prices for you soon, just to to give you an idea. But Here's all the things you can probably buy back in stateside and in Australia or New Zealand or Canada or wherever you are, but this is what's available. We're gonna look at all of these. The 850s and the RR, beautiful bike, fast as. Bit of a retro style. This is a heritage, nice bike. Actually, cool looking bike. There's some ones over here. Look at this thing. Beautiful. This is this is trick looking this one. Very nice. Got all the the gear on the back, the helmets, etc. So have a look. 
S1000, they're a very nice bike, XR1000. And then you've got the 750, F750, triple black, 750, nice bike. Good stuff. Oh, there you go, oh, an F900R, and then you've got some, a scooter, a C400 scooter. That's nice, it looks comfortable. Looks very nice, actually. C400X, the S1000R, naked. Very good. So there we have BMW in Cebu. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll try to get some prices and let you know. If you've got any questions, just message me. Bye. Hi, viewers. KDM Mandawi in Cebu. So let's go have a look in here and see what we got. We're looking for the 790 Adventure. There's one in the window. Oh, nice. So let's have a look in here. Oh, they've got the, the V-Strom over here. That's uh, Looks like the... Oh, that's a thousand V strong. Busy bike shop. So they've got uh, oh CF Moto. They're a cool bike. I've I've never been into a store where they've got CF Moto. This is the the 450SR. Cool looking bike. Bit of a boy racer thing, but um, it's all right. And then you've got your Jukes. Let's go around this side where we can actually walk around and have a look. Peugeot. Peugeot scooter. Very interesting. I heard they were coming to the Philippines, but I didn't know that was a... That's a nice bike. Peugeot... Diang... Dangio, Danjo or whatever it is. It's a trick little scooter. Got all your standard sort of... Kawasaki 750, 650, etc. My favourite little Kawasaki 900. Uh, come around here. Kid in a candy shop, viewers. Kid in a candy shop. Kimco. Taiwanese. I thought they were Chinese, but Taiwan. You know, off the mainland. All in the news. So that's the Kimco. Scooters. NMAX. Ah, some KDMs here. CF Motors. Yeah. And then we've got some KDMs here. Oh, this is a, a Benelli 502. I've seen a few of those. I'll get back to that in a minute. And then uh, we've got our KDMs here. The RC200. The RC390. And then... Oh, that's the 1190 KTM Adventure. That's the older model. I think they've, they've got the 1290 now. So, And then... Uh, this one over here, which I'm not quite sure what this one is. What is it? KDM Adventure. Looks like a bit second hand actually, so got all these and the Jukes and back to this Benelli. This Benelli is a nice looking bike. I think they're very cheap too. Got a Benelli like a bit of a low rider type bike there and then, then this one, the 500, 502. Look at this, very trick, Y wheels, looks the part, actually real, really solid aluminium um, um, grips, sorry, and then here, comfy seat, very comfortable seat, nice looking bike, rack, So this is something, I'll find out prices and I'll post them and let you know, all right? So KDM in Cebu. Talk to you shortly, viewers. So viewers, last stop, Harley Davidson. Harley Davidson in Cebu, in Mandawi. Nice, nice looking place. So we'll go in and have a look and uh, have a look at some Harleys. I'm excited as always. So, must be a service centre. Yeah, there's a bit of a service centre there, nice Harleys. Oh my God, look at that, a trike. Let's have a look at this trike. 
look at that. I reckon there's some money there, viewers, in that truck. I've got no idea how much, but uh, you get all sorts of Harleys over here. Look at these. This is the adventure version. They're a bit, bit space agey. What are they? What CC? 1250. Nice. I don't know how good they go on the dirt, but they look pretty trick. So they sell them here. So nice. So if you're in the Philippines, you want a Harley, here's where to come. Don't bother with Dumaguete. Maybe Manila's probably got the same, but you got some nice Harleys here. Look at this. That, I think, from my recollection, is about a 2006 model, this one. And you got all sorts of Harleys. Here we'll go in, go into the shop. It's going to be cooler in the shop. Here we go. Nice shop. As Harley does it very well with their marketing and their shops. So you've got all the... It's pretty much the same as walking into a Harley Davidson dealer in the States or in Australia. You've got all the stuff. So Let's see the prices though. That'll be interesting. This is what you've got available. Sportster, here we go. A million pesos, about 20,000 US for a brand new 1250 Sportster. Geez, they look great. Uh, then you've got your, your bigger 114 Cube. Let's check out the prices on that. 1.46 million, fat bob to fat bob. And here's that adventure. Harley, don't know how much that is. Oh, here we go. 1.5, 1.6, or two tone, 1.63. And then the street bob. I won't go over all the prices, but this is a, this is a Road King, 2022 Road King, 1.7. Nice bike. Road King Special. Here we go, getting up there, 1.9, Road King Special. Low rider. Price is 1.7. Sports Glide, 1.48. So there you go, so that's the Harley shop. So as you can see, you get a good variety of bikes here in the Philippines. You can, you can buy them, a lot of them are a lot of them are made for the Asian market, so they're lowered suspension. So I know the BMWs were all lowered suspension, so just for the shorter, shorter people. So uh, there we go. All right. Well, I hope you've enjoyed that bit of a tour around Cebu's bike shopping, but it's uh, 35 degrees Celsius outside, and we've had enough of shopping for now. There's pr probably a few more bike shops here and there, but there's Triumph that we didn't get to cover, but maybe next time I'll cover that. But... Uh, for now, I'm signing off uh, from Cebu and Harley-Davidson, and I'll catch you next time on the channel. Viewers, thank you very much. Thank you, Mother, for the rabbits.